another live broadcast okay now today i'm going to be explaining the question what is a septic tank pump what is a septic tank pump because probably 40 percent of septic tanks up and down the country actually cannot um, exist or function without a pump so what is a septic tank pump well let's have a look so here's a typical scenario that many septic tank owners find themselves in and it's a very strange one right because in this instance the soak away is uphill right the soak away is uphill and as you know typically septic tanks work via gravity all right so what does that mean well water comes out of the septic tank typically and then it drains away for example streams and rivers flow into the ocean the ocean sea level is the lo lowest point on the earth okay what i mean is you know uh, you know above the waters you know sea level before you actually go below water to the ribbon bottoms of the ocean what i'm saying is on land the lowest point of land is sea level all right and so all the rivers and all the streams flow into the sea all right so typically septic tanks work via gravity you know it comes out of the septic tank it goes into the soak away it goes through uh, the soil through the fields into the brooks into the streams and then makes its way into the sea so what happens and what happens if your soak away is uphill because you can't defy the law of gravity and this is the situation we find ourselves in here's a septic here's a soak away that's actually if we go to the septic tank now here's the soak away uphill so how on earth right how on earth do you get the stuff in the septic tank right up here well that's exactly what i'm going to show you okay and thankfully due to some very clever people so let's give you the scenario here so all right so let's take away the the panel and so here we go let's fill the tank up with water okay so we've got to get all this wastewater now up the hill here into the soak away how do we do it how do we do it well some very clever boffin invented a pump all right so i know that sounds strange but let me show you exactly what i mean so here we go so this is called a pump chamber all right this is called a pump chamber and it's very very clever it almost works on a on a on, on like a ball cock like a float switch so you remember the old systems you had like a ball cock in uh when the water um uh, fill when you flush the toilet the system would then fill up and the ball cock would rise and then it would shut off and it would be loaded ready to flush again well a pump works in exactly the same way so here's all the wastewater from the septic tank now from here because it can't go uphill it goes first of all into the water leaves the septic tank let's, let's go in for a deeper dive here it leaves the outlet pipe on the septic tank and actually makes its way into the pump chamber so there you go so the pump chamber now is full of water all right so now we've got to get it how does it get it up the hill well first of all all right if your soak away is uphill the first thing that you need to connect the pump chamber and the soak away is an inspection chamber all right and the inspection chamber from the inspection chain to the pump chamber you need to put a pipe all right it looks like a hose pipe agreed i've made it green just for illustrative purposes okay so here we go so the pump chamber water comes from the septic tank it goes into the pump chamber and then it makes its way up to the soak away so how does that work well let me show you let's go closer in inside the pump chamber is where all the magic happens so let me just take the water away inside as i said there's a float switch like a ball cock in, in the old systems and what happens is as the um, pump chamber fills up with water the float switch will rise okay and when it rises to a certain height it then the motor will then kick in so let me show you all right so you get water comes in from the septic tank through the outlet pipe and it fills the chamber up all right that's pretty explanatory so far isn't it okay then the float switch inside here 
will then rise doom, to the top. Did you see that? I'll do that again. I'll go a bit closer. So there's the float switch there. All right. So before it was here. And when the water goes in, it rises to the top. There you go. And then what happens is the motor kicks in and it sucks and draws all the water out from here. So let me show you that. So whoosh. So the water sucks all the water out, right? All the water then is discharged and travels up this pipe into the distribution box here. And then it's distributed into the here, look at that. So let me just slow that down. That's going a bit too fast, that is. So let me just, there you go. Look at that. How cool is that? So it makes its way up, and then it goes and is discharged into the soakaway here. Look at that. That's cool, isn't it? All right. And then from there, the soakaway can naturally, all right, naturally do its job and soak away into the ground. And that's it. So if you've got a septic tank, right that's in a normal situation but and you'd be surprised how many people ring me up right and you've got a soak away uphill then all you need is a pump chamber all right it's a pretty simple solution it's an amazing invention whoever came up with it okay so there you go that is how that is that is answered the question what is a septic tank pump and more to the point that's how a septic tank pump works so listen thank you very much for watching my live broadcast today um many people ask me where they can catch up and see more of um of my live broadcasts i've done say say you're working and you can't watch them well if you just go to septictank.co.uk you'll see there it says septic tank tv if you if you click that you'll see here I've got loads, hundreds of videos, that um, live videos and free tips and advice that I've done to help people. So if you want some late night TV viewing, here's lots of videos that I've done there. So yeah, so just go to septictank.co.uk and you'll see Septic Tank TV on there. Well, this was a live broadcast and very soon I'm going to put my live broadcast on my website so you can actually watch them live but listen thank you very much for taking the time to watch my live broadcast today have a great day and i'll speak to you later